do this? Tuesday, Monday, Sunday, Saturday, Friday, Sunday, but yeah, do you know that we've been walking for four days? You heard what that judge said. Get out of town and keep walking. Yeah, I didn't walk so much to the middle of my feet and back up to my stomach. Oh, daddy, go talking about your stomach again. Yeah, but my stomach is talking to me for four days. Don't you know that I'm old? And she never heard what the good book said. Man don't live with bread alone. Yeah? Man don't live without bread alone either. I've been drinking so much water that my stomach thinks I'm taking and washing. Well, the trouble with you is your brain is in your stomach. Yeah? Is that what's been ground? Boy, you bore me. Why don't you lift your mind out of your stomach and feast on the beauties of nature? Look at them rolling hills and that grassy valley. And look at them fleecy clouds just fleecing along there. And look at them big, beautiful rocks with the red sort of running into the browns and the browns just melting into the green. That's what I ain't none of them. The trouble with you is you ain't got no soul. Is you telling me? Phew, good gracious of me. Good gracious. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Do my perfect thing. Boy, good gracious. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, you, you worried, ain't you? you? You ain't got nothing to worry about. I'm gonna get us a good job. Us? Don't it always? What was the matter with that last job we had? The last job that we had? You mean the last job that I had? I done all the digging. Sure, you done all the digging. Anybody can dig, but what would have happened if I wasn't there with my brains to boss the job? Suppose you got over ambitious, lost control of yourself, and just kept on digging and digging and digging, 50, 60, 100 feet. Well, you'd probably have gone on digging and come out on the other side of the world, in China. Then you're in a mess. You can't speak Chinese? Oh, I'd have stopped way before that. All right, then you stop. Then why is you? You're in a hole. And how you gonna get out if I ain't on top to get you out? That's right. Sure, that's right. We have to get all about that and look to the future. The next job we get is going to be a white collar job. Uh, like a lawyer, doctor, judge. Which kind of job would you like me to pick for you? Well, any job, I don't care, just so we get some meat. I just want to find out how food tastes once more. Now, that's a job. You hit it. Hit what? Food taster. Now, what is that? Well, a food taster, he's a man who sits in a big overstuffed chair with a big spoon in one hand and a fork in the other. You know how them cans run on them belts before they put the tops on them? I don't know. Well, a food taster, he sits. And when them cans pass him, he's got to taste each one of them. First comes a can of soup. Lots of tomato soup, chicken soup, and potato soup. And follow that comes cans of beans. And follow that comes along the cans of ham. And chicken with the gravy running clear back to the kitchen. After that comes the dessert, such as canned peaches, canned prunes, canned pineapples, and even canned plum pudding. And he's got to do that all day, except for the hour he takes off for lunch. Now, how would you crave a job like that? Yeah, what's the matter with you? Uh. In adjustment. Brother Blake, that sign, sanitarium, and country club is a very good non diplomy. But you ain't fooling nobody. Remember what the great emancipator said? You can fool some of the people lots of the times, and lots of the people parts of the time. But you can't fool no politician at no time. You said it, brother. They got eyes in the back of their heads and ears all over their faces. And palm that's always itching. Here. Yes, sir. Unfortunately for you, you was right. But this will do a heap of scratching and do you a lot of good. Well, I've been done good for a long time. I've got to go to work. Get out of here. Uh oh, oh, what do you mean, oh? So how come all the time that we pass, we've got the same name? Same name? What are you talking about? Every time that we pass for the last four days, his name Gauss Now, look here, here comes another Gauss Lau. Gauss Why are you seeing it, Gauss Lau? Yeah, yeah, it's right over there. See it there? That ain't Gauss Lau. That reads Go Slow. Sure enough? Sure. Everybody knows that. One day I got to take time off and learn you something. You is one of them close together readers. Yeah? Yeah. Gauss Lau. <laughs> Over here, come on. There he is. Now look, and you go on the inside and get the chicken. I'll stay on the outside. If anybody asks any questions, I'll tell them I'm a chicken inspector, and you is my assistant looking for a parasite. Looking for what? Come on, go get the chicken. I'll, I'll explain to you later. Go, go, go. Two cents in a row. You're pretty good. 
Better can't do it again. Uh, is you talking money or just conversation? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have to my talking. Uh, would you like to join the conversation, brother? Well, I don't mind speaking a word or two. Well, you gentlemen sure can around a pocket full of words. Yes, sir. That's the loudest quiet talk I ever saw. Go ahead, let me do it again. Go ahead. Uh, do it again? Do it again. <laughs> Baby, they don't believe you. Come on, show me your own language. Come on, show me your own language. Go on, get up. Come on, get up. Let me do it. Go on, get up. Let me do it. Go on, get up. Would you gentlemen care to continue the conversation? I'll take half of it. Hey, but that's too stupid. Put your hand on it. Put your hand on it. Don't let it go away. Come on, shoot, shoot. Come on, shoot. Who said do it again? Who said do it again? Come on, shoot. 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 Come
Well, brother, now that you see the light, I want you to know that you've nothing to worry about. You see, I handle the things, providing I got the things to handle things with. Excuse me. Daniel! What's going on? Remove that. Excuse me, honey, what's the matter? You ain't jealous, are you? No, I ain't jealous. I ain't gonna stand for nobody getting in touch with you. Except me. Hey, what's the matter with you? Are you crazy? What did you do that for? Didn't you see him fussing around with Oh, honey, he wasn't bothering me. Shut your mouth. Certainly he was bothering you. And he was bothering me because he's bothering you. You're gonna keep this up? You're ruining our business. Well, I ain't gonna stand for our business. What do you mean, our business? Well, I'm connected with it uh, indirectly now. And you got me worried. Suppose you hit somebody so hard that you killed them. And they died. Even the chairman of the investigating committee. I couldn't square that. That's right, honey. He's right. Shut your mouth. Go get to work and do your singing or whatever you're gonna do. Anthony, where would you be? Never mind where I would be. I was right here now. And as long as I was here, ain't nobody gonna get fresh with my gal. Well, get out of here. No, sir. I'll do one touch thing. I'm gonna stay right with you, but you just never get down to zero. Let me go to the board, is everything all right, Mr. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Thank you, Daddy. Don't you, I'm happy to say something. Why ain't nobody with us, either? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not, I've been cool. Fine, sing one for me. Why are you singing? Thank you. Swear I want that for me, too. Don't you try it with me. All right, boy, give it back up. Give it back up. Give it. Oh, little, 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 little. Oh, little me. Oh, little me. If all I am is a dumb one. Never been killed. What? And I am still. That all I need is someone. Don't want to sing. Huh? You, you, you tell me, huh? Come on. Don't want to read for the love in my need. Does anybody care? Don't want to dance. I'll go in the trance. I'll think about all of them. What's in my mind can be clearly defined. Does anybody care? <laughs> you think I ain't here? It's what I'm longing for. Husband's love, not too much. I gotta have breath for more. Don't want to cruise. I look at the moon. I'll sit alone on the stairs. Have me go. I'm so ready for love. Does anybody care? Don't want to cruise. I don't read a book. I never let her declare. No, that wouldn't do. Cause I want to. Don't want to care. Don't want to gamble. I want to put on air. I just want to chance at a little romance. Does anybody care? No, I'm too strong to hold that note. What I'm wrong for. Ah, I just know not to love. Ah, I gotta have bad for more. Ah, I'm in the mood for being with you, and I'm not the kind that cares. Heaven's a road. Keep it up, boy. Keep it up. You got it. If anybody cares. Cool down, I'll go. See that you stay cool. Well, don't worry about me. I'll take care of my temper, too. Here we go again. I promise you, don't do nothing with this for. Clay, you better get your friend off the desk when you want to get him on your own one piece. How come? Why? Well, see, it's his gal. What do you mean, Doc? Nobody else but. Now, but I'm going to put him in jail, put him in jail. Uh-oh. Yes, if you ask me, you're overdoing it. I was not. Oh, boy, I've got loads of money. Roll that big. Give me the ticket. 
There is. Sure. And I'll do one about that crap game of yours. Well, that's different, honey. I apologize to you. Don't be apologizing to me. You better go out and apologize to them. Maybe I'd better. Guess I will. That's what I'll do. Come on, gentlemen. Oh, what are you talking about? Come on, let's get out of here. Yes, yes, this place is not good enough. Anyway, come on, let's get out of here. No, no, wait a minute, gentlemen. Just wait a minute. Uh, please, please, please. Hey, wait a minute. Stand back. <laughs> did, did I do that? Well, good gracious for me. I ain't that something. Here's to a friendship that comes the hard way. <laughs> oh, right away. You heard about that? Yes, sir. Gone by, be gone by. <laughs> Hey, you know something? Uh, a little guy, you show pack a big wallet. Oh, was that the huge money punch? Oh, that was my wisdom punch. I bunch of little goes with my sucker punch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing that. I'll put that away. All of this is on me. Sorry, gentlemen, you're both wrong. This is on the house. Your money is no good here. No good here? That's right. I can tell you can use it. Hmm? Well. Yeah. Hmm, sister, now you are speaking my language. What have we been waiting for? Come on and lead the way. I'm never heard of it. Wait for this place. Come on, Jeff. Yeah, come, boy. Yeah, come. Yeet. Come on. Come on, pick it up, pick it up there. All right, let me show you. Let's ride. Come on, jump up on the train and train it. Leave it. Here we go. Don't miss it. Let's ride. Come on, throw the dice out. If you don't want to, come on, boy. Oh, you're getting on this. Let's make it a big show. Oh, you'll be hot. Come on, dice. Seven, eleven. Use your own judgment. Eleven. Ah, ah, ah. Down here. Dice, you show you your judgment. That time. I'll take over. Come on, go on. Let's make it a little dice. Show that you right there. Ah, what's the matter? Don't you trust your own dice? Yeah. Oh, these ladies are cool. I can warm them up a little. But yeah, baby, let these on me and keep me lucky. Why don't you want me to? Why don't you want me to bend it? Money in your pocket don't roll that down yet. Go ahead and bend it. That's it, baby. Come on, stop holding up the game. Shoot. Don't, don't, don't rush in. These guys don't take the cue. Well, here yeah, I go. <laughs> Give me some time, Jim. Don't grab it. The point of four. Little Joe. Boy, that was close. Many needs a new hat and baby needs shoes. Show it to him the hard way. Give it to him, too. Go ahead. What did I tell you, honey? <laughs> Didn't I tell you that? If you stick with me, you wear diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not dead in my life. If I'm dead, here I am. If I'm alive, where am I? Feet, can you move? Because if I try and you don't, then I know I'm dead. Well, here I go. Give me the answer. This thing's got us. I can't stand it much longer. You said it, brother. I have had a sleep. I told that place. I told Ezra what would happen if he left the place to that no good nephew of ours. Jitterbug and jiving and hullabaloo. You know we're up here. Something got to be done about it. Come in. Come in, nothing. Come up here quicker, Ezra. What's the matter? What's the matter? What are you supposed to do up here? You ain't changed a bit. You can still sleep through anything. Don't you hear that noise? Yeah, it is. Ain't it? Yes, there's something got to be done. Get your house here, though. You've got to do something about it. Go on over there and hush him up. Where will I get my hat? You know you ain't got no hat. Get along. Wait a minute. Look there. Where'd you come from? You don't belong here. You don't tell me. Go on, get along, Ezra. All right, I'm going, all right. My clock run down. What? What time is it, child? What? I say, what time is it? <laughs> Thanks. Little Phoebe, anytime you're so Phoebe, you're getting close to death. <laughs> Don't get enough. Ah, there it is. Look at that. Look at that. Ain't that something? <laughs> uh, any part of it, all of it. 
I'm sorry, son, but the bank is busted. I'll tell you what I'll do, boys. I'll make a sporting proposition with you. I'll bet you the house here against what you got in front of you. House? What do you mean, the business and everything? Yes, the house, the business and everything that goes with it. Everything? Yes, everything. Wait a minute. You, how do you feel about it, Joe? I don't know. You feel lucky? Uh-huh. You feel happy? Maybe. Sure you ain't overshot yourself? Uh-uh. You know what the book says? Let it run up alone. And that sure looks well enough for me. It's been the kind of well-known. You've been landing them around the door for a long time. A whole lot of land ladies. And a lot of those. Well, make up your mind. Hurry, boys. Just suspense killing me. But does we or does we don't? We don't. Uh, over the room. We're done. Come on, nice. Uh-oh. Box cars. Yeah. And that's why we'll be sleeping if you lose. Box cars. The call of the open room. The light in the wide open spaces. Uh, you know, Mr. Blake, I was just talking to my doctor. My doctor told me to have a whole lot of fresh air. I'd have to have a whole lot of sunshine. So I thought maybe if I went in this place here, it would keep me cooked up too much, and I wouldn't have no fresh air. So I think we better call the whole thing off. Don't you think so? Uh, now you're talking, son. Yeah, on. talking too much. The best down. Come on, pick up them dice. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute, Mr. Blake. Now, wait a minute. Now, you told me when we first started, it was going to be a friend again, but now you're talking about real estate and everything like that. Now, you know you're Pick up them dice. Pick up them dice. All right. Uh, this land is a break up an awful beautiful friendship. Uh, little brother, uh, give us a room. Don't hold me down. Uh, give me that dice, Wendy. Get that dice. Can you all find it? Uh, never mind, brother. Would you give me that dice over there, please? Dice. Dice, your father's talking to you now. Dice, come on. Just, just, just one more time. Just one more time. That's all, dice. Just one more time. Trippin' Cat Bishop, do it again! Lady, look, I knew you would. Ah. Give it all, Dice. Ladies and gentlemen, there has been a slight change of management. So, for the rest of the evening, the party is on the new orders. Me and my partner, Mr. Washington Delaware Jones. <laughs> Me and my partner walking down the street to the dive all dinner. Where's that? Who's the matter? Well, who doesn't tell my partner? You know, a new establishment. But the shop is too much for you. Yeah. Well, honey, looks like I've lost everything but you. Get your hat and coat, please, leave it. Ha! What do you mean, me? <laughs> Baby, you're a wonder. <laughs> give me hands in and I'll give you hands out. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no good. That's the last straw. I'm going in and clean out this joint. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You don't want to sleep tomorrow. You know, there's such a thing as a law, and they've got the law on their side. Have they got the law on this side? Say, we've got some thinking to do. What do you mean? Come on, we've got to go to the town. Here I come. Well, well, happy judgment day, folks. Judgment day, nothing. That noise is coming from over there. You got a lot of time yet. Well, look, what are you folks doing here then? Waiting for Uncle Ezra. Here I am, very judgment. What happened? Jay White is dancing, drinking, gambling, and cutting up just some trouble. Got to face unchanged hands right under my nose. It looks like it's going to be worse than ever. That does it. My patience is exasperated. Let's go over there and give him the works and close the place up once and forever. You said, sister. Come on, let's go. No, Mr. Ezra, it's going to be a pleasure. Yeah, it's going to be a pleasure for both of us. Take it away, Mr. Ezra. And the door opened and closed all by itself. And that's the last I remember. Well, if I was you, I'd lay off that gym. No, it wasn't that at all. I tell you, I've seen him and heard him with my own ears. Boy, you sure is in a bad way. Hearing footsteps and seeing doors and talking about death. Keep that. Oh, here you come again. Uncle Edward? Is that you, Uncle Edward? Yes, Daniel, but I ain't got time to stop and talk to you now. Give me your hand and help me up these steps. Did you hear me, Daniel? Yes, ma'am. Yes, what time? Uh-oh. Do you like your sister? Uh-huh. Here they come again. Again? Yep, sir. Hey, they're with the fellas. This place is haunted. Haunted? Uh-huh. Come on, sir. A little fresh air does a lot of good. Let me get this straight. You think we can get the sheriff to throw him out and lock up the joint, and then we can come back and open up, and everything will be rosy? Is that what you think? All right, I don't think. I know. Okay, then. That's just what we'll do. Come on. Oh, no, you won't. Is he being watched? Bruce Blake, you have turned out to be the blackest black sheep in our whole family. You know one thing? If I didn't know my Uncle Edward was dead, I'd swear that was his voice. That's who it is. Uncle Edward, where's you? Right here. 
And I've come back to tell you that we are thoroughly ashamed of you and the way you've been running this place. And we're glad you lost it. If you try to open it up again, we're going to haunt you 24 hours a day as long as you is here. To say nothing of what we'll do to you when you join us in the hereafter. Now get out and keep going. Yeah, that's all the And you too, you old scared friend. Yes, sir. Do you mind if I join you? Boy, it sure gets the spot. Get the Get out. You ain't seen nothing yet. No, I ain't gonna wait to see nothing. You know, there's something wrong about this place. The lights going off and on all the time. I'm, I'm so nervous. Ha, ha, ha. 